Property owners in Gainesville are examining a trail of destruction after a man tore through town with a stolen excavator. And his wild ride ended with him gripping a machete and a Walmart. TV 20's Ethan Badowski walks us through the destructive journey. True Florida man. This is the scene left by 47 year old Trent man Jesse Smith, who took a stolen excavator for quite the ride from a construction site behind Butler Plaza. Smith ripped through Storage Depot of Gainesville, tearing apart numerous units with the bucket on the machine. I was here at 5 in the morning this morning, and just seeing the damage was shocking. Even in the dark, you could see that it was, it was pretty epic. And after rampaging through the storage facility, the driver ran over a fence, drove through this field behind me ran over a power pole and another fence before heading off to the Walmart to continue his path of destruction. Drever's gym is about a football field away from the field Smith tore through, and he said he felt lucky it was not damaged. I've got members that are family. This gym is like family. So when you see something and hear something like that, immediately you think of the safety of your people, and you're just immediately concerned. And after causing even more damage, this time to the facade outside the automotive shop of Walmart, the driver went inside wielding a machine before he was arrested by police. Immediately within minutes, we're starting to see word of mouth stuff popping up. Oh my gosh, he smashed into Walmart. Oh my gosh, he's got a machete. And, and we're like, oh, you know, you're just super concerned. That's, you want everybody to be safe. Employees at the storage unit say police found crack pipes inside the excavator. Officers say Smith caused more than $2 million in damage and faces charges of grand theft and property damage. In Gainesville, Ethan Badowski, TV 20 News.